Well, hello everyone. This is Oscar, Professor Bonet, one more time. Uh, by request of one of my good friends from Iowa City, uh, Gami the Clown, I am going to post how to make a balloon lion. And I ain't lion. <laughs> uh, oh, come on, Lisa. Come on, this is funny. It's funny every time you tell it. Okay. All right. Anyway, for your lion, what you need is one yellow balloon, leaving maybe about four fingers of tail. You need a blue, but I will show you a variation of the lion at the end, so you don't need the blue for now. You also need a brown for the main part of the lion. Get it? <laughs> they didn't get it. Anyway, you need a brown balloon blown up all the way for the main. But when you do this, give it a good burp. You know, look at the difference. The yellow is fuller. This one seems a little bit skinnier because I gave it a I gave it a, a big burp. And you're also going to need a 5 inch white, about the size of a ping pong ball. Okay? All right. We take the brown one first, tie them together. So we got a little circle. We got a little circle. Hi. Okay? We find the center. And we're going to divide it in three parts, just like if you were doing a basic six petal flap. Okay? We know how to do it. If you've done a flower before, you know what I'm talking about. Squeeze it together and twist. So there you have six petals for a brown flower or the main of the lion. All right, so you put it on the side for a moment. You take your yellow one, half an inch little ball, another two half an inch balls. Lock the last two together. So you have the head of a mouse. Okay, take that nozzle, stretch it and put it right in between there. So you get the muscle of the line. Okay. You get your mane, you get your brown balloon. Look what I do, I put them together like this. So you got the mane, the nose, and the two chicks. There. Starting to look like a lion. Okay. You go a couple of inches to the back. Twist. Twist. Just a little ball. Make an ear twist. Okay. So that's the neck of the lion. Maybe like about an inch and a half bubble. And then I would say about three or four inches bubble. One. Two. We got the front legs. We got the belly. About four inches. And then two more legs about the same size. Of the front legs. The rest is just the tail. Curve it a little bit. Okay. So the only thing missing now is the eyes, and that's how we're gonna need that round balloon. By the way, just to let you know, my wife is in the background going. No, no, no. I got it right here. Ha! And I'm gonna put it right there. Love you, Lisa. All right, you take your two eyes, just squeeze it from the bottom of the face up, and with a one or two twists, okay, so it's getting there. Now you take your Sharpie, <laughs> you know what I said? Yes. I, I said, <laughs> You know, she used to laugh at my jokes before, but it's another story. Hmm? Hmm? Mm -hmm. Now let's put a nose there. And let's put some whiskers. One, two, three. One, two, three. And 
now this just straight up a little bit the face and the tail and here you have your line okay let me get it a little closer to the camera can you take a look Lisa to make sure that it shows okay and this is from the side all right now a little variation that I do sometimes is that you take a blue balloon or any balloon color that that you, that you like do a loopy twist another loopy twist another one I got three and let's do four four so the objective is to have something like this like almost like a four petal flower on a stick Sometimes we will put hearts here to make a, a little girl, you know, like a, a princess one. But this, what we're going to do is that we're going to take a uh, scrap of balloon. Um, I don't have a scrap of balloon, so let me do this. I'm going to pop, okay, with your thumb and index finger, okay. I usually have scraps of balloons everywhere, but for some reason I cannot find one now. Anywho. Okay. So we still have it. We have our scrap of balloon. We take the lion. We put the scrap of balloon through the legs of the lion. Kind of like put them together. Come on. Come on. There we go. Okay, so the two legs are together. Just tie it up with the blue balloon. Yeah, stay there. Now you have a lion on a stick. This is if you have time, if you're doing line work, you might not have time to do this. But for a birthday party, or if you have time on a line, you can just give the child a balloon on a stick and it looks awesome. All right. Till next time, my friends. This is Oscar, Professor Von Air, and my lovely assistant, Lisa. Have a good evening. Bye.